The mouth is one of the most important parts of our body. We use it to do some pretty important things like talking, eating, and smiling. I'm here to talk about a section of our mouths that helps us to do all of that. I'll give you a hint. Adults have 32 and children have 20. I'm Dr. Kevin Brunsden, a pediatric dentist and a participating dentist with Delta Dental. If you guess that I'm here to talk about your teeth, you're absolutely right. The more you learn about them, the better you'll understand how to keep them healthy. Let's start by looking at what makes up a tooth. It may look like one piece but it's actually four. On the outside is the enamel. That's the hard protective coat, harder than even bone. Just under that is the dentin. It's not quite as hard. Then comes the cementum, a softer tissue that covers the tooth root. The pulp is at the center, and that's where you'll find the blood vessels and the nerves. Teeth come in different shapes and sizes. Look at the teeth in the front and center of your mouth. There are four on top and four on bottom. These are your incisors. You use these to take bites of your food. Just to the side of the incisors, you'll find your canine teeth, sometimes called the eye teeth. These are your sharpest teeth, and you use them to tear food apart. The rest of your mouth is made up of premolars, molars, and third molars. They chew and grind food. Notice how their surface is bumpy and has lots of grooves? This is where it's very easy for food to get stuck. This wasn't always the case. Our ancient ancestors used to eat nuts, berries, seeds, and vegetables. Our molars were perfect for that kind of diet. But now that we eat softer foods, like carbohydrates and sugars, we need to brush extra carefully. These foods will stick to the bumpy surface of our molars, causing cavities. The tongue is also important. It helps to move some of the food from our teeth. One of its jobs is to move food around the mouth until it's the right consistency to be swallowed. Certain conditions restrict the tongue's range of motion, leading to digestive problems. For example, tongue tie can prevent a person from processing food properly. In addition, if your teeth don't meet together properly and you have a bad bite, this can also make it difficult to process food. So you can see that your mouth is one of the most important parts of your body and your teeth have a vital job. They must chew food to a consistency that allows our bodies to digest it. When they don't, we run into problems. Large pieces of unchewed food cannot pass smoothly through your digestive system. They also may stay in your stomach for a longer time. This can lead to constipation-based disorders, which can arise as a result of our bodies not being able to absorb the foods we are eating. You could feel these effects when you develop heartburn or indigestion. Chewing your food thoroughly will help keep your digestive system working efficiently. Now that you know how important your mouth is, you should take care of it. Your dentist can also show you how to take good care of your teeth so that they will last a lifetime. And that's something to chew on.